Hey everybody, welcome back to Lyrical Resonance, where we believe that where words fail, music speaks. I am excited because I am getting into another instrumental song. This is the song Revelation by God or the God Project. Um, and so I'm, I'm excited. I did a song for them. I did two, actually. It was the very first, uh, like, double header video I've ever done. You can check it out here to their song Messiah and Rain. Um, this is the song Revelation from their album God for Revelation. Um, this is uh, really, really awesome. It's from a guy who is working anonymously. Nobody knows who this guy is, which I, I find fascinating. And there's a reason for that. It's because he wants everything he does to point to Christ and to point back towards God, our creator, which I was like, dude, okay, that's awesome. Uh, I remember saying in my first video that I was like, I don't know um, what the name's about, but I understand it now. It's it's to point everything back to God. So I could get behind that. Um, it's all instrumental. It's amazing. He is actually working on putting out uh, 33 albums, 33, which is a really awesome number and i am looking forward to hearing more so this is the song revelation off of the album for revelation from god now if this is your first time here thank you so much for tuning in i really appreciate it uh, we're going to listen to the song there are no lyrics so there's not going to be much for me to analyze lyrically but we're still going to listen to it and enjoy if you like what you see by the end of this i'd ask you to like the video and if you haven't already hit subscribe to stay up to date with everything we're doing because or words fail music does speak and we're going to continue listening to what it has to say. So let's do that now with God and their song, Revelation. I love this. Sounds so good. Nice cleans. See, this is the thing I love about this uh, this particular project is there's so much like dynamic sound that comes from everything they do. You've got really heavy, like chunky, I don't know, chug heavy music that just sounds epic. But then you have this too where it dials back and it's just this really crisp, clean sound that is just ambient and moving and it sounds so good. And there's so many layers to it. And, and so this song being called Revelation, you know, it's an eight minute song. We're almost two minutes in. And man, I, I just imagine like, I don't know, it to me, it sounds like the soundtrack that we kind of imagine in our own lives. Like if I were to be given some divine revelation, I almost wonder if this is not like what I would be hearing as it becomes clearer and as the, you know, the vision happens, it's just, I don't know, it's, it's how I imagine things, but I love the sound of this, man. I'm going to back it up just a few seconds and we'll keep going.
Okay, so... Okay, so is this, like, where things in the Revelation start getting really screwed up? Like, like if, I, if I'm picturing this from the perspective of, like, John, as he was receiving the Revelation, right? Like... <laughs> is could this be like the soundtrack where he's like oh man this is getting real bad like stars are half the or a third of the stars are gone a third of the sun is gone um dude a star just crashed into the earth and then like, like you know this is just what i'm picturing as i listen to this where it just it's I had that sudden shift into aggression and whew, man this is good stuff <laughs> okay, that that shift. Okay, number one. How, dude? How do you make instrumentation like that where the guitars sound menacing? Like it legitimately sounded like like okay, I this is hard to hard to describe, but like it sounded almost like the guitars were coming for someone's soul. Like it was powerful and mean sounding and I really really was impressed by that holy buckets dude and it just didn't let up and then just as suddenly as it went into that aggression it comes out into this light melody that uh is beautiful you know and i just the the, the ebbs and flows of this are just fantastic and again those layers and the way that aggression kept building and getting just more and more intense Whew, dude this is good stuff I'm going to back it up just a little bit again, and we'll keep going. This is nice, man. Real calm, Mel. Oh, it's gonna get mean again. I can feel it coming. Maybe not. Maybe I was wrong. Okay, so we're back at where we started.
है I love this man. The bass sounds great. Uh, okay, I'm gonna back it up again because there's that as that guitar comes in in the background, you can kind of feel it as it the volume comes up on it, but it's got that that really nice that melody coming in again where it's higher up on the the frets and you can hear it and it just sounds dude it sounds beautiful and almost like almost divine man it just sounds so good and it's a nice uh, a really really excellent compliment to um just the uh lower tone of the bass and like palm muted guitar that's playing behind it it just the way this all builds, man, is astounding. All right, let's keep going. Backed it up a little bit just so we can hear this come in again. I like the way this is just kind of carrying out like that. Hmm. All right, so there you have Revelation from the God Project. What a song, man. I uh, really, really liked that, and it just, it sounds so good, and <sighs> peaceful. Uh, even that really aggressive part, the way that it was blended in and kind of put into the middle of really, really harmonious and light moments um, was fantastic. Uh, fantastic. The the placement of that, the arrangement of this, was really, really well done. Really smart. Um, very well thought out. And uh, yeah, it just it's amazing how, as you listen to this, you can kind of picture what the creator had in mind as they made this. And it's just, dude, it's so cool. Uh, this this the whole concept of this project. I mean, this is the fourth album that uh, this anonymous person has put out um, and what's really cool is on Bandcamp a lot uh, I think I think their stuff is free on Bandcamp 
um, because they want it all again it's their ministry they want everything they're doing to point back to christ and man if you don't feel like even without words in this if you don't feel the spirit in it like man this is this is the kind of music that is like blessed music to have man like i'll just put this on just to have in the background um you know as i'm reading or whatever just it's so good and it doesn't like it doesn't it's engaging without being obtrusive and just the the amount of integrity and passion that's put into it like you can feel you can feel something in the music even without any kind of words you can feel the weight and the depth of this just within yourself you can feel it as you listen so i I really really enjoy this man this is becoming a staple in my music listening uh gosh i love this all right uh i'm gonna give this song if i were to put it on a scale of one to ten honestly this one's gonna be a ten man this was so good i loved i loved the wonderful balance between heavy and light um that having that aggressive moment in there which again i'm i'm wondering if this is just kind of like a preface to everything else where or preface however you want to say it um but where it's kind of introducing the entirety where there's moments of beauty terror <laughs> aggression and light to it and i just and triumph as well and so i wonder if this is going to kind of just be like a precursor to the rest of the album like a kind of like an intro or a forward if you will um but yeah really good 10 out of 10 song i enjoyed it tell me what you thought about it in the comments below if you enjoyed it if you hated it uh, if you're indifferent towards it i want to know um and big thank you to uh god the the uh, anonymous dude that's putting this together um or dude at um pretty sure it's a guy though um anyway based on conversations uh that i've had through email and uh just messenger and stuff so anyhow thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it let me know again your thoughts in the comments below what do you think about it uh, on a scale of one to ten one being terrible ten being amazing what do you think and if there are any songs you want me to get into let me know and i would be happy to add them to my growing schedule you can let me know you can leave me a comment or you can email me at lyrical res oh, let me try that again at lyrical.resonance.ia at gmail.com it's floating down here so even if i say it wrong you should be able to get it anyway thank you so much for watching if this is your first time I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for taking the time to watch. If you liked what you saw, I'd ask you to like the video and then subscribe to the channel because where words fail, music does speak even when there are no words. And we're going to be here listening to what it has to say. And uh, before you go, maybe watch one of these videos here because you might find a band you haven't heard yet. Maybe you'll find uh, some thoughts I have on a song interesting. But check out one of these two videos before we go. And until our next one, stay safe and be blessed. We'll see you soon.